Are there newer, uh, new, better, more creative ways constantly evolving to extract more profits, to extract more profits out of each deal and to experience fewer headaches? That number eight statement is what the associate community is all about. Would you guys agree? Yeah. It's, that, that is precisely what it's about. <coughs> what I'd like to get with the, with the mic box is from the associates who, let's say, have at least one deal because you've interacted a lot if you have at least one deal. Uh, a comment about Slack, the community, and how that's helped you, and, and from someone else, a comment on how the weekly associate Zoom calls help with this number eight issue. I'd love to hear it. So I think for me, I, I would say both, but I guess I'll focus on the Zoom, the mastermind. So one of the biggest questions I had when we were first getting started was, for people that have done deals and experienced headaches, what, looking backwards now, what did you see, if anything, were red flags for buyers? Like, if you had somebody default, is there anything in retrospect you may have seen then, you know, that indicated this might be a problem down the you road? You threw that out on Slack? Yep. Okay. I think that was in our, I can't remember now. I mean, on Zoom. One of them. Right. So, somehow we talked about it as a group. And I think consistently every single time anybody that's had somebody default, their, their consistent answer was not taking enough of a down payment. Yep. So we are, you know, we, we always consult with you guys too about possible buyers and, you know, I think we will not take any, anybody that is too low. Even how badly we want to sell something, we will not take it if it's not big enough. You know, we, we're all sort of altruistic, but if it's not going to work, yeah, I think, deal. yeah, exactly. Like, you know, you said that to us multiple times. We'd rather have you have no deal than a bad deal. And even Bill yesterday said, you know, we want to help people, but not at the expense of ourselves. So I think that has been super helpful for us. Great. And I'm being assumptive again, so let me clarify. The Zoom is a, the weekly mastermind on Thursdays at 5 o'clock that the associates jump on. Every week, uh, everybody jumps on. It ranges from 29 to 39 people on answering each other's questions. Pretty cool. Mm -hmm. And we, once in a while, I'll bring a guest on. Well, me and Chris were sitting there just, uh, and Lauren called in. As she had, they got a property right now. And she called in and was like, hey, I got this buyer, and they have X amount down. Like, what should I do? And this was at like 7 in the morning while me and Chris <laughs> were just having like our coffee. And we walked you through it, and you didn't accept them. Right. Or we brainstormed about other ideas on which you should go back. And that was at 7 in the morning with coffee. So, so that's to Don's point of always getting us. That, that was an early morning. Yeah, don't call me at 3 in the morning, but you know, you anytime past 5, I'm good. <laughs> Let's do a Slack comment then. Who's, who's, and I don't care if you haven't had a deal, actually. You could be brand new and Slack's been helpful for you. I shouldn't have called. So who's been on Slack that's found it helpful? Slack is the community, again, private for the associates. While the mic's being passed, within Slack, there's a high 6 channel, for those of you that aren't in it. There's a lessons learned channel. There's a script channel where we put live calls for each other and, and comment. Um, that has to be, the, in my mind, that's like one of the, the best channels. I mean, you're getting live calls weekly. Privately. Or daily from, from either associates or us recorded. So you can learn, the new, like when you're going through your scripts, you can hear so many people's different styles because eventually you interpret the scripts into your style. And once you do that, that's when you start accumulating some real deals and some real leads. Uh, so just being able to hear that, I, it's, it's amazing. Who has the Slack comment? Josh, go ahead. Yeah, I, uh, we've, we've been about a month now, and I wasn't sure what Slack was at first, and I've been getting used to it, but it's, it's great because we have the whole community on there, and you ask one question, and you can get just tons of answers and different answers, and it gets just some... Uh, some thought provoking, and uh, I, I've really liked it, and I think it's a great benefit. So, well, and just so people know, Josh, how many years in real estate for you guys? Twenty-two. Twenty-two before so. this, and he's finding it helpful. It's just a different niche. Great. Thanks for sharing. Mm -hmm.